of the flesh, these are not the children of God. You see, children of the flesh are not the children of God. Read. But the children of the promised are counted for the seed. Read verse 4, Romans 9 verse 4. Children of the promised are counted for the seed. You must be of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. But you see, but you call yourself Muslim, you are from Abraham and Ishmael. You are not for Isaac and Jacob. That's what you are doing. You take yourself out of God's covenant. We are the God-chosen people. We must come from Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. But you, when you follow Islam, you are from Abraham and Ishmael. You are not from Jacob. So you are not the children of God. That's what you are doing. See? In order for you to be the children of God, you must come back to, to the Bible as the Israelite. And do what the Bible says. Read verse 4. Who are Israelites? Who are Israelites? Read. To whom pertain the adoption? You see, the adoption pertain to the Israelite God. The glory. The glory. The covenant. The covenant. The giving of the law. The giving of the law. The service of God. The service of God. And the promises. And the promises. All this pertain to who? The Israelite. It doesn't pertain to Ishmael or Muslim, bro. Or Christianity. Or Christianity. It doesn't pertain to. You see? So the white man came here, they do all this thing. Either you are a Muslim or you are a Christianity. But the two of them has nothing to do with the Bible. You see? So you must come out from these two and call yourself what? The Israelite. Old Testament. What? Please, please not. New Testament. New Testament. We read from the Old Testament to the New Testament. Old Testament, New Testament is the same thing. You see? Because we Muslims believe in Old Testament. I'm talking to you okay. as a Muslim, I believe in all those I see before, all, the, all of them, they, they have their own names in Muslims. Mm -hmm. So they believe in Jesus Christ, mm -hmm. so that it's a messenger, it's not a son of God, it's just a messenger. So we believe all of them, they are all the prophet, they are God sent. Right? So as we are talking now, not guys, I myself, when I was growing up, I saw my parents going to Presbyterian. Now, I can read. I can reason. If they were going to Presbyterian Church on Sunday, I can start asking, how, why are you good people going to church? Which law says that you should go to church? You see, from there I started reasoning that there is something wrong. I now started teaching them. After I, I, I was taught, and he taught me. He is the one who taught me. He taught us. So we started keeping the law. Remember, Sabbath, so look, we go, we go now. So from from then, I am now the one teaching my parents. Now, what you people had previously was wrong. Let us go to the Bible, look at the Bible, reason it together. I teach him. He came in equally to Mamenda. He met him. He asked him questions. He explained it again. So from there, he he stood. He learned something, and now. He equally he abstained from church service on Sunday. He now keeps Sabbath day only. So it's something for you to look at me. Example, I will look for a day. Uh, I don't know where you before. No, there, there's a contact. Yes, our number is here. This is our number. I will look for a day. I heard our number is translated to our something that is in your Bible says. Let's see what. Quran and the Bible says, yeah. teach us, right? Yeah. 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 So, we yeah. 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 know the Quran too. 